Hey, hey, Blue Table fans. Here we have for your perusal today an Avenger Strike Fighter. It is a model put out by Forge World for Games Workshop's Warhammer 40K game. In the grim darkness of the far future, there is only war. And there's also a lot of really cool models. Uh, this model, as you can see from the uh, scale of the Valkyrie base here, which is approximately five inches stem to stern, uh, that this model is pretty hefty. It weighs in probably about the size of a Valkyrie Vendetta, and <clears throat> it is a very detailed sculpt. We'll go in for some some closer looks, and uh, this is a custom piece like we do here at Blue Table Painting. If you check the liner notes, you can see how to get a hold of our inquiries department to get a custom piece of your own done, and we are a full-scale, full-time reliable and secure commercial operation that has a number of full-time artists available at all times to get your project done. And uh, this particular model is, uh, in the game, it is a strike fighter intended to conduct high-speed, low-level attacks on ground targets with armored vehicle formations and high-value strategical strategic assets such as munitions dumps forming its principal prey. I'm reading off of the uh, notes from the Forge World site itself. It's an ancient design believed to originate in ancient Terra sometime during the Age of Strife. So, uh, all right. So anyway, um, in the game, this thing has a ton, an absolute ton of options. Uh, if you take a look at the front here, uh, you will see that it has, it has five points here two on this side, two on that side. And uh, I do believe this is an auto cannon, last cannon, last cannon, auto cannon. And um, so there's absolutely a ton of, uh, so the, the main weapon here is an Avenger bolt cannon, and then it gets uh, two wing mounted last cannons. And uh, these are, oh, these are actually heavy stubbers, defensive heavy stubbers. So those can fire at a different target than the other weapons as long as it's uh, within the gun's firing arc. So that's kind of a cool feature. You can kind of just peel those off. It would be uh, magnetized, magnetized on. Hold on. Here we go. There it is. Fits quite comfortably. All right. So, um, yeah, so it can take all sorts of missiles on there. Uh, it can take... Uh, extra auto cannons or auto cannons to begin with tactical bombs and it can take uh, four different upgrades including chaff launcher and infrared targeting so let me tell you there's a lot of stuff you can put on this the avenger bolt cannon is um strength six ap3 heavy seven what up with that uh ballista skill three though like uh like all other types of imperial uh, flyers. It does have front armor 12, which is really, really interesting. And uh, so, um, let's see here. Uh, what else is unusual about this? An auto cannon. We already know what an auto cannon does. Um, Hell Fury missiles are pretty cool. They have a 72 inch range, strength 4 AP5, uh, but they're a 5 inch blast, no cover saves. So I say yes, please. All right, let's take a closer look at, um, closer look, uh, clear skies at competitive prices. That's fantastic. Uh, Van Dyer's Revenge. So, uh, there's some, some free hand on there. And, uh, yeah, definitely. This is really, I gotta just tell you, it's a really cool piece. Uh, we've done something really neat on the base here. Uh, these, um, plants are actually, um, the, uh, the, the trunks here are, are real branches um, found off of some local foliage. So anyway, uh, there it is. That is the Avenger Strike Fighter by Forge World. And I hope that you have enjoyed and got your inspiration for the day.